maybe you can just tell us what in particular you, you touch on completely on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, on my weekdays, I, I actually I, I, I touch on uh, almost everything. Yeah, <laughs> like what you said. I wake up uh, as early as four in the morning oh, and wow. I'm straight to my gym. And, wow. Uh, I do at least four sessions and yeah. then... Uh, four sessions? Four sessions. Training. I have aer aerobics and also weightlifting. Okay. Uh, and then after that, I also do um, uh, the, 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 art, the artist side of me. I'm oh, a wow. Uh, I'm a comedian. Sometimes I do uh, d directing. Yeah. I do the art directing and, uh, and um, also acting. Yeah. Um, um, then uh, come evening by five, I'm supposed to be back to my place. And then I get back again to a gym and I leave the gym. As, again? Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. I leave the place at uh, exactly 10.30. Uh, wow. So fitness is also a, like a part of you, mm. um, even without being a trading. It's, it's something that's very important to you. Yes, my yes. passion. Now, how do you maintain or how are you able to balance or manage your time in a way that you're able to do all these things at once? People keep asking me that question. Yeah. It's, 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 I don't know why it is so difficult uh, for, 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 for people to understand that provided you're happy doing whatever you're doing, exactly. you can do a lot. You don't feel like you're working. It's like a routine. You're happy doing what you're doing. So yes. it's not really like work to you. Like you said, it's your passion. Mm. So you're happy doing it. It just passes by as you just go through your day. Yes, it's because I don't fail in what I like. Doing. Yes. Mm. yes. That's yeah. the thing about it. Okay, that's amazing. And yes. very that's encouraging a, to see as well. Like, Jim, will you to cook, like... Karibu to na home too. No, uh, not Karibu na home. Yeah. Actually, my front yard is a gym. Ah, okay. There you go. Yes. Yeah. So that makes I opened my sitting room door yeah. and out. Welcome, yeah. guys. Gym, gym. Yes. <laughs> now, how did you get into doing all these things? At first, what did you start by doing in school? Um, I was a very sickling boy. Okay. I, 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 I grew up uh, as in, there's no way I could... Uh, Finish like uh, two months yeah. without Kukwa Mgonjo. Yeah. Mm. So I ended up, um, uh, one of my teachers, when I so much respect so yeah. much, he got me core fitness in terms of uh, football first. Mm -hmm. And then the moment he realized that now exercise is the thing that I really need, yeah. of which I think everybody out there really needs exercise. Yeah. Mm. Um, uh, it has always been my thing. And then I noticed with a stronger boot, you can do everything. Stronger body, a relaxed mind, yeah. you can do literally Absolutely everything. Anything. Yes, of course. That's true. And yeah. how, I hope you don't mind me asking, but how has the fitness also helped um, you in terms of your illness and what you've been going through? I'm sure it's drastically changed from that. Yes, it's funny. Yeah. Um, like uh, seven years, Bila Kwanda Ko Hospitali or something like oh, that. Wow. Yes. Wow. Congratulations. Yes, yes. Look that's at a good that. thing about it. Exactly. Mm. Yes, and um, I think the last time I was in hospital, it was an accident. Yeah, yes. so sorry about that. that was just I'm a... Chef Bennett. If you want to watch more videos, just click on the side. If you want to subscribe, click down below.